In this video, we're taking a look at Pro Content and specifically how it works inside of ProPresenter. Pro Content is the media library built right into ProPresenter. It offers thousands of dynamic and unique media to choose from to make your presentations look incredible. What really makes Pro Content stand out from other media subscription services is its seamless integration right inside the software. You don't have to jump between websites, download folders, or import windows. Everything happens right inside ProPresenter. Let's take a closer look at how it all works. There are two easy ways to sign into your Pro Content account inside ProPresenter. The first is through the Accounts tab in ProPresenter Settings. From here, you can sign into an existing account, which is the same as your Renewed Vision account, or click Sign Up to create a free account or upgrade to a paid Pro Content plan. The second login option is right inside the Media Bin under the Pro Content section. When you click Sign In in either location, ProPresenter will open a browser window and take you to the Renewed Vision login page. From there, just enter your email and password and click Sign In. If you ever forget your password, just click Forgot Password and follow the link sent to your email to reset it. Once you're logged in, head back to the Accounts tab in ProPresenter Settings. You'll see your name, account type, and plan level listed right there. You can also click Manage Account to open your account page in a browser where you can make updates or changes anytime. To sign out, go back to the Account tab in ProPresenter Settings. Pro Content lives inside the Media Bin, and it's always just a click away. Click the Pro Content button in the toolbar. If your Media Bin isn't open, ProPresenter will automatically open it and take you straight to Pro Content. If you already have the Media Bin open, but you're viewing a playlist, clicking Pro Content will switch that view over to the Pro Content tab. And here's a little shortcut. If Pro Content is already open and you click the button again, it'll close the entire Media Bin. When you open Pro Content in the Media Bin, you'll see several categories. Each section contains rows of content you can scroll through. Just hover over the area and use the arrows on the left or right side. Or if you're on a Mac with a trackpad, you can simply swipe left or right. Looking for something specific? You can type a descriptor like mountain or vibrant in the section labeled search pro content. Anything with a free tag is free to download without a subscription. If you want to see everything that's available, including design assets and pro presenter themes, click the globe icon next to the pro content label. That opens the full Pro Content Library in a web browser, where you can browse, search, and explore even more visuals. Here's where things get really convenient. You can download motion graphics, loops, and countdowns directly from Pro Content into your media bin without ever leaving ProPresenter. When you're browsing through the featured, new, popular, or free sections, you'll notice motion graphic packs displayed as thumbnails with titles across them. Each pack contains multiple motion graphics. When you hover over a pack, you'll get a live preview of every loop that includes. If you like what you see, click the download button right on the thumbnail. This downloads all the motion loops in that pack straight into your media bit. Just note that countdowns and stills from the pack are not included in that automatic download. Once you click download, ProPresenter will ask a couple of quick setup questions. First, choose the resolution you want, 4K, HD, triple wide, or double wide. Next, pick which media bin playlist you want to save it to. You can also select Add New Playlist to create a fresh one on the spot. If you'd rather preview everything first, click on the pack's thumbnail instead of downloading it right away. This will open all the loops, countdowns, and stills included in that set. From there, hover over any individual file to preview and download just that one, with the same resolution and playlist options available. And that's a full walkthrough of how to access, browse, and download media from Pro Content, all without leaving ProPresenter. It's a simple, built-in way to keep your presentations fresh and visually engaging while saving you the hassle of managing files or switching between apps. Thanks for watching, and as always, for more tips, tutorials, and updates, be sure to check out renewedvision.com.